poop to Harry Turd. Hi, and welcome to BBN, Pat Brad News. I'm your host, Bradley Jessica Calder. And I'm your co-host, Patrick Walsh. In today's news, we regret to inform you that a student at DeVry University was at a face-off and his opponent literally ripped his face off. He had never played this sport before, so he took the term quite literally. Our condolences go out to him, his family, and his teammates. Should we uh, brighten it up with some celebrity news? That's right. We like to call this segment, Pat and Brad make puns off lacrosse celebrities' names. Let's start it off. We've got lacrosse celebrity Paul Rabel. Paul Rabel, more like Paul Bunyan. Am I right? Because uh, he's got bunions on his feet. Paul Rabel, more like uh, Paul Stable, Ooh. because he, like a horse, <laughs> sleeps standing up. Paul Rabel, more like Mall Rabel, because no one likes to shop at him during the holiday season. Paul Rabel, more like Fallout Boy Rabel, because he can dance dance. Thanks for those memories, Paul. Thank you, Paul. Moving on, we've got Kyle Harrison. <laughs> more like... <laughs> Mile Harrison, because he can run fast. Kyle Harrison, more like Tile Harrison, because he says no to linoleum. More like Kyle Harrison, because he has lots of hair. <laughs> Moving on, we have Billy Bitter. More like a Billy Twitter, because he loves social media. Billy Babysitter, because he'll watch your kids. Billy Bitter, more like Billy Critter, because he is a lover of small animals. Moving on, we've got Rob Pennell. <laughs> more like Rob Pennell, because he's a burglar. More like uh, Glob Pennell, because when you have him at your Thanksgiving dinner, he'll just take the mashed potatoes and glob them right up <laughs> for scoops. Rob Pennell. More like slob Pennell, am I right? What a slobby person. I invited him over to my house the other day. I said, hey Rob, I'm throwing a little get together. It's a quinceanera. He said, sounds great Brad, can I bring anything? I said, of course Rob, I'm supplying the 15 year old, just bring some tacos. He brings over a Taco Bell 12 pack, what a nice gesture, until he leaves all the wrappers on my floor. Looks like someone's not getting another invite. Rob Pen <laughs> Now going to entertainment news, uh, we actually, we took a poll, mm -hmm. uh, we, we pulled some lacrosse players for their favorite movies and TV shows, and the movie, unanimously, was Max Seabald's big move. That's right, and when it comes to TV shows, people liked a little 90s drama television with Lacrosse's Creek. What a classic. Some James Vanderbeek. Alright, moving on, we're going to turn it over to Pat with the lacrosse weather. Pat? Well, you see, lacrosse is a sport played all across the world, so therefore, lacrosse weather is all the weathers. You heard it here first. If you guys are going out to play lacrosse, remember to bundle up or put on some sunscreen. Now, let's turn it back over to Pat with some sports. Pat? Lacrosse. Thanks, Pat. Well, that's our time for PBN. I'm Brad Calder. And I'm Patrick Walsh. Thanks for joining us. Good night. Thank <laughs> you.